Hello everyone out there in YouTube land. I'm the Scent Maven. Welcome back to my channel. Shopping in scents. I almost said voting in scents. Uh, so if you're wondering why I'm wearing this, this is from Old Navy from last year during the presidential election. It says vote now. Uh, we've started early voting in New York for, in New York City, for offices like mayor, comptroller, uh, some other local offices. So I got like, a lot of compliments at the polling site for my Vote Now shirt. And yeah, somebody was like, where'd you get that? And I was like, I got it at Old Navy last year. And some people at, um, that I knew said, oh, why'd you buy that shirt? You know, um, you're only gonna wear it once. No, I'm gonna wear it all the time. People vote all the time. There's always some kind of election. And then why am I still wearing my mask? Cause somebody at the polling site gave me a really good tip. So, you know, I was wearing, I was using defogger on my glasses and now it's not working. It was working inside the site. She told me if you do a double like that on your mask and you make an air pocket, make an air pocket here and here, it'll prevent your glasses from fogging up. It was working inside the pole site, now it's not working so much. Now, I'm trying to get my earrings untangled. I tried to get in some other earrings this morning. They will not go through my ears. I really gotta get the holes in my ears fixed. Um, these are the only earrings I can wear right now. So I'm a little bit sidetracked. I look like a hippie. Uh, I will, no, let me do that again for, for somebody, for the, uh, for my, my website. Anyway, <laughs> I'm going to go pick up the boyfriend now. I'm already late. I'm already late. So I'm going to get moving, 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 moving. I don't, sometimes I don't like this, this head, you know what? I don't like this headband on me right this moment. It's crushing my head and it's making my forehead look big. I'm taking this out for a little bit. Okay, I gotta get moving. So I went in the Dollar Tree and look what they had. They had a case of adrenaline shock cotton candy. A case. There's 12 in there. I always secretly hope they're gonna scan it as one item, but they never do. because I notice men are a little more chatty with me lately. Come on. So, this guy was funny in the Dollar Tree. He closed the register and he's like, he's looking at the people because they didn't move. And he's like, what are you doing? I know you know, <laughs> he's like, I know you speak English. I know you understand what I just said. I am closed. <laughs> I said to him, maybe they're pretend, maybe they don't want to believe it. And I was like, they better believe. <laughs> he said to me, they better believe it, because when they get up here, they're going to be real disappointed. <laughs> Am I having fallout? This is the hard candy filling mauvey palette. I swear, I'm getting fallout. Uh, somebody, somebody recommended like um, Too Faced. Too Faced products or something. They said it prevents fallout. I gotta try that. Let me show you what I got in the Dollar Tree that I didn't pick up yesterday, which I needed, was these big ass rolls of toilet paper. I got some water, just for myself for now. I had to pick up snacks for the boyfriend because I didn't get him snacks yesterday. So I got him the Lay's stacks they're not broken. I feel like some of them are broken. Stacks in the mesquite barbecue and the bacon and cheddar. I don't know. And then I also got him some uh, bugles. And then I picked up this. I want to try this. This is Colgate Zero. It says zero artificial flavors, sweeteners, preservatives, colors. Clear mint Clear gel spearmint. Mm -hmm. Never heard of it. Then I picked up some foot powder. They had the Arm and Hammer 
talc free foot powder. Because you know I get ingrown toenails and then I get like a fungus under my toenail. I don't know how I get it. But then they have the Assured for Men. This must be for Father's Day. It's a razor with two extra blades. So I figure I tried that. Try it. I figure I try that. Then I got only one of this because I think I have this already without the liner. So they had the hard candy. They had one hard candy. This is the Mataholic. Mataholic Velvet Mousse Lip Color and it's purple. And then it says bonus lip liner. I don't know. I feel like I have this color. So I only got one. It's the only color they had. And then I got two. One. Two of the Nestle Splash. They're making it in acai or acai grape. So that's what I got. Now I know people said they get irritated when I put this stuff away on camera. So I'm going to put this stuff away. And then I'll talk to you guys later. You know, at first, <clears throat> I was going to say, well, I have to take my medicine. But at first... I was thinking, you know, I don't need to buy a whole case of uh, cotton candy of the adrenaline shock. I was only going to get a couple of cans. They also had a couple of cans of the sour candy, just like three cans. But I didn't get the sour candy. I like the sour candy, but I like the cotton candy better. And I don't know if this is going to be... A product that they continue to get in and I'm telling you that cotton candy it's addictive I've been replacing my coffee in the morning with either the bang rosé rosé or cotton candy adrenaline shock my diabetes medicine oh by the way there's no sugar in the, those drinks. Wait a minute. I think I, I, think I took the wrong thing. Um, and actually I noticed not only men being more chatty with me, but actually women being more chatty with me. Um, do you know why? I think that is. I think it's when you feel more confident and you feel better. Like I've been doing my makeup, like trying to do my makeup every day and put on some jewelry and, you know, feel more confident. I think that sort of radiates out. I don't know where I put the cap to my water. Oh, there it is. I'm super late picking up the boyfriend. He's probably pissed. I don't know. I was wearing this this morning, but it came off. Well, I had to take it off. Had my breakfast. I have like all coral tones today. So I was wearing this today, which matched. This is um, the Mega Last Liquid Cat Suit. And there's actually like somebody wearing a cat suit. Mega Last Liquid Cat Suit Metallic Lipstick and this is 949A Bally in Love. Okay, he said he's coming downstairs. Now if I do this like this, you're not going to be able to see it. I'll put it back on so you can see what it looks like. It's got the doe foot applicator. I didn't know that until recently. And they call it a doe foot. See, it kind of all blends in together. I needed a contrasting lipstick today. I need a tan in order in order for let me fix this. I need a tan in order for all this coral to look right. Try this again. Mm. 
Yeah. I feel like it's very monochrome. Today, my lip, my um, makeup. It's a lot of corals and mauves and stuff. Now we're gonna go get lunch or dinner. It's almost well. It's yeah, almost four, almost four o'clock. So, lunch and dinner, one or the other. I hate this line. What is this line that I have here? Is this a mature woman line? What is, what is that? Can I Botox that out? Okay. Okay, guys. So I'm wearing my Grateful Dead shirt. Oh, it's making me... I am looking a little chunky today. So, yeah, I'm wearing my Grateful Dead shirt. So, I went to Marshall's Marshall's yes I picked up a notepad for $2.99 did I need another one no and then the only thing that they had they had no body care no fragrances no makeup that I wanted I found this one shirt did I need another NASA shirt no but they had one with the Van Gogh painting Starry Night and it had Godzilla like spitting fire at Starry Night like blowing up the and it was really cute but they only had it in a small but I found a NASA Starry Night shirt which is cute right this will look really good with jeans if I could fit into my jeans by the winter by the fall time I really like the colors so then I was at the restaurant today and apparently they're doing a fundraiser. If you're in New York, you'll know what I'm talking about. If you're not in New York, probably not. So we have a mayoral race coming up. And so they had, they're having a fundraiser for the candidate that I happen to be supporting. Um, Curtis Sliwa. Um, you might know him because he uh, is the founder of the Guardian Angels. So I've been wanting one of these signs for a long time and they actually gave me one. They had them all over the restaurant. Curtis Lewa for Mayor, Save Our City. Um, and I, I like this one, but I like the other one that they had better. But they didn't, have, I should have asked them for the other one. The other one had him with his shirt open that says New York City like that. I wanted that one. I actually contacted the campaign because I wanted one of these signs, not necessarily this one, but I wanted a sign for my door. And they only had, they said you could order a lawn sign. And I didn't want a lawn sign because I don't have a lawn. Even if it was my house, which it's not, I, it, we don't have a lawn. So I can't use a lawn sign because it has those little metal sticks that you put in the grass. So anyway they're gonna have a fundraiser for him on tuesday usually the fundraisers there's a minimum to get in they said there's no minimum so does that mean i could just come in and have a cup of coffee i've met him before i've met him before i'm actually i should i'm gonna put in a photo of me and curtis when i met him um I, he was marching in a Memorial Day parade about two or three years ago. And I was walking back to my car and he was kind of lingering at the back of the parade and he didn't have any of the guardian angels around him. That's that's what he's known, 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 did. He's known for is founding the guardian angels. Um, so I just ran over to him and I was like, Curtis! And he probably thought I was crazy. So I went over to him and I was like, I'm such a super fan. He had a radio show. He still has a radio show, but he had a radio show on the station that I listened to that was on in the morning before work. I used to listen to him all the time. And I was like, I, I, said, I love you. And you know, he just looked at me like I was crazy. And he gave me a business card because that's another thing that he's known for. Everybody that he meets, he gives them a business card for the guardian angels. I guess that's how he keeps track of how many people he's touched, how many lives he's touched or whatever. So he really, he didn't say anything. He didn't say anything to me. I said, can I take a picture with you? And he said, yes, but he really, he was, I don't know. 
but anyway yeah so uh that was it was cool that they gave me the sign so yeah anyway i'm gonna close out this vlog because actually let me put in the picture of me and curtis curtis and i All right, I'm gonna close out the vlog because I'm just gonna be spending more time with the boyfriend. I did do some stairs today because the escalator was broken at Marshall's, uh, but I really haven't done too much exercise the last two days. So I'm gonna get my butt back into gear starting Monday, starting tomorrow. I slept really late today. Um, so I caught up on my sleep and yeah, so there's not gonna be that much more to say. So remember to comment, rate, subscribe, follow me on Instagram at Shopping and Sense. I will see you all tomorrow for another edition of The Walking Vlogs. But until then, goodbye everyone out there in YouTube land.